The Recluse is finally back, and honestly, I wasn't that excited because Master of Arms got nerfed pretty hard, only giving you a 15% damage buff every time you get a kill now. But there's a brand new perk on the gun that's practically the same as Master of Arms, but gives you an option to get 20% damage boost if you can get it to proc, and honestly, it's not that hard to get. Desperate Measures is also on other weapons as well. Weapon Final Blows grants bonus damage. This is a 10% bonus damage if I'm doing my math correctly, and if you get a melee or grenade final blow it gives you a 20 percent damage boost and this damage boost lasts for around six to seven seconds and if you manage to get a kill with desperate measures while active even if it's times two for a 20 percent damage buff it will keep refreshing as a times two over and over. The gameplay you'll be watching is only gonna have Desperate Measures, no Master of Arms gameplay because this is nothing new. The main thing is the new perk, and of course, Recluse having a maximum of 70 range now, which is actually not terrible. The main downside of this weapon still is the 13 zoom. You can't fix it whatsoever. So in my opinion, I don't think it's gonna be the most competitive SMG ever, but damn, is it a lot better than it was before. Overall, Recluse is definitely a lot better. If you wanna take it into PvP, I'd suggest using the new perk but try out master of arms too i could be wrong on this i hope you guys enjoy the gameplay let's get into it all right i need to know how much extra damage this is giving me but like i can't find anyone oh shit 23 damn that's pretty good no who's shooting my asshole oh, never mind you didn't take my kill Oh my god, how did I kill that guy? I actually got kind of lucky with that. I like that. This guy on my right side. Is he gonna peek? Okay, we got the damage buff. Times two. 25. Damn, that's not too bad. It goes from 23 to or 21, 23, 25. I like that. I could have probably meleeed that guy for uh, extra damage too. All right, so far, not too bad. Not too bad. I'm actually kind of liking this. The only thing that's kind of weird, though, is the uh, is the 23 zoom. Or, not 23 zoom, sorry. The uh, 13 zoom. I guess using an auto rifle. Which is kind of mid, but I think that, dude, this is better than Master of uh, Arms, I'm pretty sure. I haven't tested it out, so I can't, like, 100% confirm. I'm going to go into a private match before uploading this gameplay. That was kind of terrible. But I think this might actually be worth it because you can get the damage boost from uh, hitting a, a grapple melee as well. It's like a better a better swashbuckler, which is weird. I hate when they make new perks like this that are kind of like old perks, but just straight up better. Because now there's like no reason to use swashbuckler ever if you have the option of this. Got him. Oh my god. I don't know how he didn't kill me. Holy shit. Oh, I have the wrong... Uh, all right, a normal melee actually gives me the damage boost too. Look at that. Holy shit. So just a nor normal punch is really, really good as well. I like that. That's good. Not too bad. This guy's AFK. I'm going to see if I can get my melee off of him. Oh, this guy messaged me, I think. I'm going to actually go around the map. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm going to just punch him. There we go. <laughs> I don't, I, that guy was not going to win, 100%. I have an SMG. Dude, it's actually, like, not bad at all. Holy shit. I thought this 13 zoom for sure was going to be its downfall, but it's not terrible. Like, it's, it's very usable still. Then again, it's just one rumble game, so it's, like, hard to say. But this is definitely better than Masters of Arms, I'm pretty sure. Master of Arms. Okay, we got the damage perk and someone's behind me. Lasts for a long time. That's what I... Oh, terrible spawn. It lasts for five seconds. That's what I like about it. So anytime I get it to go, I can just keep getting kills and keep chaining it over and over. Again, Master of Arms is like the same thing, but you might as well use this one because it gives you the option to hit a grapple melee for the damage perk. So it's kind of nice. I'm going to back up. Also, if you switch off the weapon, looks like you keep the damage perk as well, which is a good thing. So not too bad. This should, guy should be a free kill. Like, even there, the uh, the zoom didn't really, like, screw me over. To be fair, that guy was also using an SMG. So, um, that could be the reason why. Oh, my God. The guy behind me is using the recluse, and he has 13 zooms, so he couldn't actually finish the kill, which is really good. Oh, 
There we go. This guy's behind me still. Wonder if I'll be able to get the kill or not. Or not. This guy still has SMG behind me. The guy on my right side has hand cannon. I'm just trying to like wait and see if I can play my life. I don't want to fly in and get myself killed. Guy right side's dead. My guy has nice shots. Thank God he was weak because I probably would have lost that. He had some really, really good shots there. I did not want to get my shoddy kill so I could get the damage perk. It worked out in my favor at least. This guy's weak. I think he's baiting. SMG on my right side. SMG dead. I'm going to slide this. I really wish he didn't pull a shotgun out there. I wanted an S SMG fight, but that works. Left side. All right. That guy was playing pretty smart. I wasn't expecting him just to run in a straight line at me all of a sudden. I usually don't also play with 100 recovery, so having 100 recovery now feels really good. I'm usually at around like 80, just because uh, my main account doesn't really allow me to run 100, since I have no stats, stat points to really uh, sacrifice. Free kill. Thank you. I want to outgun this guy. I'm going to go after this guy. There we go. New perk, free kill, thank you. See, that's why I kind of like it more than the Master of Arms, because I can do stuff like that. Depending on which subclass you're using, it definitely could be better. See, I got it again, reprocked it, so I'm going to see if I can kill this guy off spawn. Never mind. I'm actually really surprised no one spawned here. Oh, it's because people left the game. That makes sense, but I guess not. I'll take that kill. I want this guy to push up. No, my ball didn't damage him for some reason. I heard him walking up. Dude, honestly, audio in this game is usually terrible. Or, like, not terrible, but you don't really need it. But sometimes it could really help you out, like, right there. Just not not only looking at your radar, or relying on your radar, I guess. I'm going to back up so I don't get sandwiched by the two people on Diamond. And, uh, and, uh, what do you call it? Connector as well. That guy's holding with a hand cannon, so I'm going to see if I can grapple towards him. Instead of just trying to, like, run in like an idiot. And they're just waiting. I'm going to go for the 1v1 on the guy that spawns by himself here, then. Just give me a second. Give me like three seconds here to regen. He's won. There we go. What? He's not dead. I thought he was dead. All right, GG. <laughs> We're in a game that's already started. Maybe I can win. Maybe. I doubt it. We'll see. You never know. And I want to see if I can get this perk to keep rocking. Oh, I don't have ammo because I joined late. The only downside about joining late, sorry, is is that I don't have any ammo. So I, when I, whenever I like run into someone, I try to bust out my special weapon. I'm dead as fuck. I'm not dead as fuck. I might actually be good. I hope this guy comes back. He's fighting someone else. No, I needed that so bad, bro, because he's in first. Okay, for some reason he was just staying on my side of the shield. I think maybe if, as long as I keep bullying the guy in first place, we should be able to win. And as long as, of course, I don't die. Can you get this kill? Thank you. Stole that shit. Thank you. We're not getting any melee kills, but we're still procking the damage perk. See, if you're not getting any melee kills, I'm wondering if the other perk is going to be better. Master of Arms. I actually haven't tested it as of recording this video. I'm going to test it for the intro so I can tell you guys which one's better. Um... I was just too excited. I had to jump in and get some gameplay right away. I wonder if this guy's going to grab ammo. He did. He has an LMG, but he's not looking at me. I might be able to get him. There we go. Okay, we're getting a bunch of kills right now. No melee kills yet, though. I still have my uh, my powered melee. And there's only four people in here again, which kind of sucks. I like doing Rumble, though, for SMG videos. Because uh, it gives me like a nice idea how good it really is. There we go. As long as you're getting kills, by the way, you can keep times two going, uh, if you didn't know. So as long as I have times two and I'm getting kills over and over, it will still continue to hold times two. Interesting grapple, interesting grenade, interesting shoulder charge. I'm going to wait just for a second since I'm weak. This guy actually might just run in a straight line at me. Okay, thank you. Outgunned I was kind of scared I'd lose that because I was a little weak. That's why I was running away. I'm going to let these guys battle it first, maybe. Maybe they fight each other. Please fight each other. Thank you. There we go. And then the next guy might be on heavy ammo right now or something. My kill! I needed that, bro. Everyone left the game. I'm making a comeback, so I don't want to back out. At least this guy will probably spawn right in front of me here. Or not. On my left, though. 
I don't know if he's gonna push me or not. Here we go, here we go. I'm gonna jump up and see if I can just get a drive or a fadeaway. Here we go. Unless he also left too. It is a 1v1. Nice. We're currently, okay, I'm just gonna skip to the end.